Okay everyone, so NB Miner has uh, released a new version, so V39.7, it got released two days ago, okay? So we're gonna test out uh, the new NB Miner with my 3060 Ti LHR card, okay? And the card I'm using is uh, Gigabyte 3060 Ti Eagle OC8G, okay? So to come to this page, you can just open up Google and search for NB Miner GitHub go to releases all right so we're gonna check out some features so the new feature is lhr mode supports new ga 104 version of uh, 3060 we have uh, feature etash turn on lhr mode by default for 3060 v1 so disabled by default only on windows with the driver 470.05 okay we also have some fixes, so fix etash, so fail to detect LHR lock on certain situations. We also have fix NVIDIA GPU power consumption issue on certain rig config. And also delete support for zero. Okay, so we're gonna install MB Miner and we're gonna test out uh, how much uh, megahertz we can get when mining uh, with etash. And we're also gonna mine for Ethereum. So let's go and test this out. We're gonna go and download NB Miner on Windows, so win.zip. Open this folder. We're gonna right click. We're gonna extract this with 7-zip. Click on extract to NB Miner, 39.7. Okay. I'm gonna drag this new uh, release to my desktop like so I will open this folder and we're gonna go to start underscore ETH so we're gonna mine Ethereum I'm gonna right click I'm gonna click on edit so we're gonna edit the information right here so first we're just gonna go and edit the server uh, location we're gonna go to ethermine just go to ethermine.org like so we're gonna go under ETH go to start mining so in my case I'm in Europe I'm gonna use uh, this uh, server address if you are in Asia use one of these or if you are in uh, US East use this US West use this okay and we're also gonna use stratum port 4444 or if you are in Asia you can try this one okay so let's go back to the file we're gonna paste the server right here like so I'm gonna have uh, 4444 and we're also gonna use a wallet address so I'm using a uh, cold wallet I'm using ledger nano X so this one you find a link in the description so this is a more secure way to store your cryptocurrency so this one is offline a hot wallet is online and you don't own the key with a hot wallet with a cold wallet like uh, ledger wallet you own your own key okay so in my case I'm using ledger nano X and you find the link in the description if you'd like to get one yourself also disclaimer uh, this one is an affiliate link that means i will get a small commission if you buy through the link but this will also support my channel to make more uh, crypto mining videos okay so i got my uh, ethereum wallet address from my uh, ledger nano x i'm gonna go back to the bat file we're gonna paste it right here so delete this address and paste your own after that we're just gonna name this to your rig name, I'm gonna delete default and this one is called Sun. So everything is set up, we can click on X and we can click on save. All you have to do now is just uh, download MSI Afterburner if you don't have it. Just Google MSI Afterburner, go to this one and just click on download and install it okay when you have installed it you can click on this one msi afterburner
And also disclaimer, you overclock your GPU at your own risk. Yes or no. And now we can click on this arrow and select your uh, GPUs. Click on the arrow one more time to close this uh, list. And make sure that you have the correct uh, GPU. So in my case it's NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 Ti. Okay. So I'm just going to lower the power limit to 65. Hit enter. And we're going to see how much we can get without any overclocking settings. We're going to click on check mark. And we're going to start the miner. So we're going to double click on this one, start underscore ETH. And we also need to click on allow access if we get this window. Okay, so we're going to let this run. And after that, we're going to go and see how much we can get without any overclocking settings. And after that, we're going to go and add some overclocking settings for my 3060 Ti uh, with the Samsung memory type. Okay, so without any overclocking settings, except the uh, power limit, we get about 38.10 MHz per second when mining uh, Ethereum using ETash algorithm. So let's go and add some overclocking settings and see how much we can get for my RTX uh, 3060 Ti LHR card. Okay, so I will go and add some overclocking settings. So in my case, I'm using Samsung uh, memory type. So I can add some extra memory clock uh, settings. If you have Hynix, I recommend you to start with maybe 800 and work your way up so increase with the 50 if everything is stable all right so in my case i will overclock this uh, card hard to get the uh, maximum uh, hash rate all right but if you want to overclock your gpu uh, with a lighter overclock you can do like 1250 or something like that in my case i will see how much i will get so i will do 1450 uh, for core clock I'm gonna add minus 502 uh, power limit I'm gonna leave this at 65 uh, you can also do uh, out to fan speed or uncheck this one and add your own fan speed I'm gonna have mine at uh, 80 after that we're gonna go and click on check and we're gonna start the miner and see how much we can get Let's double click on start underscore ETH. I'm gonna let this run for a while and we're gonna see the results. Okay everyone, so with this uh, overclocking settings for my RTX uh, 3060 Ti LSR card, I get uh, 46.68 MHz per second. We have uh, power consumption at 129. We have CTEMP 62. Uh, I may increase the fan speed on that one. We have a uh, performance efficiency of 360. Okay everyone, so this is uh, how much I can get with my RTX uh, 3060 Ti LHR. So this is uh, 46 MHz uh, per second when mining with the new NB Miner 39.7. You can also join our Discord server. Uh, we are all about mining. Okay everyone, so you find the link in the description to my Discord server. We are all about mining. So if you have some problem with your RTX uh, 3060 Ti, LHR card, you can go to overclock LHR card, go to this one 3060 Ti LHR and here you can ask uh, questions if you have some problem. You are most welcome to join, link in the description, have an awesome day, take care and bye.